Hey guys, I forgot how to be a YouTuber. I'm not gonna lie, this is the first video I filmed since I've been back at my apartment, but I am pre-filming this for a Vlogmas Day. So, welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. Today, I'm going to be doing a little grocery haul. Obviously, like, every week is gonna be different, um, depending on, like, if I have anything left over from the week before, what I'm making that week. This week is a nice, giant haul because last week was Thanksgiving break, and obviously, I didn't want everything to sit here while I was gone. We're really starting from scratch here. When I go grocery shopping, I always go with a list. I'll like prep everything I want because I want to go like straight to the point and I don't want to like veer off into the unhealthy things. The goal is to try to be a little bit on the healthier side, I would say. I'm not perfect. I'm a college girl, but with that being said, I try to be as healthy as I can. When I came here, obviously there wasn't a bunch of junk in here. So if I don't have it, then I'm not going to eat it. When I go to the store also, I have these cute little bags from Target. They were like literally one or three dollars. It is literally so much nicer because getting to my apartment, it's a maze to get in. So having to carry a bunch of bags is not it. So this has been a game changer. So the only meals I cook are breakfast and dinner because at lunch I get it at the sorority house. Every week again looks a little different, but I usually go for like a vegetable, a fruit, a protein, and usually rice. I'm first gonna start off with Walmart. I went to Walmart and Sam's. For produce, I got some peppers, switching it up. Got some baby spinach. This I put in my smoothies usually, or I'll like cook on the stove for dinner, or I'll freeze it once it starts getting bad. And then I'll put it in my smoothies. I got two broccoli heads because it's cheaper than getting the already pre-cut ones. And then I also got some pomegranates because I was watching a TikTok and this girl's eating pomegranate seeds and they're fire. So this is gonna be a good little snack. I also got some grapes. Grapes are always in my grocery hauls because I wash them all at once and then I'll put like half in the fridge and half in the freezer because frozen grapes are so good. And I get the dark ones because they have like the most like nutrients or antioxidants. I don't really know what this category is, but I did get some pasta because this is good for when you don't have anything else to cook. Then I got some sauce for my chicken, which you'll see later. It's the G Hughes sugar-free sesame teriyaki marinade. I tried another sauce from them a couple weeks ago and it was so good. So it was their stir-fry sauce, fire. And then I got some yogurt. This is my favorite yogurt. It's the Too Good yogurt. There's only two grams of sugar and it just tastes really good. I got the mm -hmm. vanilla one. Mm -hmm. I don't know in the next category, liquids. I got some coffee. This I go through way too fast, but it's the Starbucks Blonde Roast. I used to just use espresso pods, but this has just honestly been way easier. So Blonde Roast is my favorite. It's lighter and it has more caffeine. For creamer, I got the zero sugar Italian sweet cream. This one is so good. It's what my mom uses at home too. This I decided to get because it's really good for you. So it's just 100% cranberry juice. Tastes really tart and bitter, but it's super good for you. So I just got the Great Value brand because it was like $3 cheaper and it had the same exact ingredients as the one that was like $9. That's all the food stuff from Walmart, but I'll go ahead and show you the miscellaneous kind of items that I got too that I needed restocked because why not? Got some detergent because I use this and then I use like a scented detergent too. And then the candles always get me and our TJ Maxx one is gone because we use them all the time. So I got this one. It's the winter woods one. It smells like Christmas. And I got some Q-tips and some concealer because I'm out. Got the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. I've used probably 25 of these. It's so good. Total at Walmart, I spent $75.52. But again, this is gonna last me and some will carry over to the next week, so. Next, I'm gonna go through my Sam's stuff. Notice how there was no protein in my Walmart stuff. It's because I get it at Sam's usually. The last couple weeks I've been getting a rotisserie chicken because you can literally get so much chicken off of it. And it's $5 and it's already cooked because one thing about me, <laughs> one thing about me is I'm scared of cooking chicken because we don't have a meat thermometer. It's just dry and it's, I get scared. God, we all get scared of it. So hey she's guys. cooking some sausages back there. Cooking sausages, <laughs> chicken apple sausages. You can buy them at Walmart. They're really good. Yup. Easy, quick and easy. Little lunch. I guess since we're on the meat section, um, I got these. They're just grass-fed ground beef. Um, it's organic. She's a big organic girl, so she influenced me. But I like how you can get three of them. I just put them in the freezer and then thaw them in the fridge a day or two before I want to eat it. It's good because it can go in pasta, you can just make ground beef and rice and a vegetable. I got some cucumbers just for a little 
snacky snacks since I didn't really get snacks. And then I have some ranch that I made in the fridge. And lastly, this is usually stocked. Everyone usually has one of these, but um, I got a Caesar salad to switch it up. And then my favorite is the apple bourbon. It comes with so many different things that you can put in it, but I take out the bacon and then add like real bacon in it. And it's fire. I don't really know how much the total was for Sam's. I think it was like roughly $30. I also got like a little puffer jacket there. It was like $30, so it's around there. But yeah, again, this stuff will last me. So that's my grocery haul. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know if you want more of these because this is actually really fun to make. And then hopefully it gives you guys ideas. Yeah, that's all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I love y'all so much. <laughs> I'll see you in the next one. Bye.